Hello everybody, the one and only Ripcod here, and today we're going to be talking about the Call of Duty World War II supply drop system. What I'd like to see in it, I mean, surprise, surprise, we know there's going to be supply drops in Call of Duty World War II. So let's just see, like, let's just come up with the best supply drop system that we would like to see that would benefit us, the players, the most. Also, we got some Battlefield 1 Battle Pack openings for you, because, well, you know, I love playing it's the Battlefield, so... I'm hoping that Sledgehammer is taking all the best aspects from BO3, IW, and MWR supply drop system and putting them into one game. I think that'd be really cool to see and it'd be really, it'd make it a lot more fun, the supply drop system a lot more fun. And, uh, Advanced Warfare supply drop system, it was kind of cool, you know, anticipate what guns you're going to get, you know, it was always, you know, kind of like, oh, am I going to win the lottery, but overall it's probably the worst one we had. Uh, some of the things like the Black Ops 3 supply drop system I like is the contracts. Now, I know the contracts have come later in the life of Black Ops 3, pretty much towards the end, but they're really a great addition. They reward you for uh, playing the game, and they encourage people to play the game, which is really good. And they're pretty they're they're pretty easy to do. They're not too challenging. You know, you just gotta play the game and you get more crypto keys and get more. You got a better chance of getting those weapons and different skins and all that. So in MWRs, you know you can uh, earn the weapon. You can earn the weapons of salvage, but it takes way too long to get salvage in that game. Oh my god! Like it just feels like such a grind when I'm you know, playing that game. It's just not fun. Like it's just the thing about like. The only good thing I'll say about IW is that they give you daily salvage for logging into the game or getting onto it, which is good. It's really nice. They said that in MWR. Also, I don't know why Modern Warfare Remastered and IW don't have this. They don't have the daily double and six pack that Black Ops 3 has. Like, I just thought, you know, why would that not be in there, you know? I, they, they should give us some kind of deal. I just, I don't understand why the daily double and six pack aren't in those games. I really just find that kind of mind-blowing but anyways I just hopefully Sledgehammer is going to implement they're gonna take the best aspects of each supply drop system and put it into their game but knowing Activision the bunny whores that they are they're probably gonna find some way to mess it all up and just, just I don't know it's probably gonna be really bad but I don't know, I just I really hope that they just really listen to us and just put make the supply drop system fair and make it to where it rewards the player and encourages them to play the game. So I just wanna thank you guys for watching the video. If y'all enjoyed, tell me in the comments what you wanna see in the supply drop system and tell me if you're hyped for Call of Duty World War II, because I'm really hyped for this game. And I'm gonna be uploading more videos like this. This is really but the first time I've done a video like this so I'm gonna start uploading a lot more start streaming and stuff uh, also shout out to my boy Vbudge Mods uh, go subscribe to him and me and him are gonna start we're gonna start a new podcast the channel is a uh, cringe on demand so it's gonna be if you ever watch baited podcasts it's gonna be like kind of like that covering like hot topics and, like uh talking about Call of Duty and video games so shit like that so it's gonna be pretty fun so we're gonna have other people on there too so go check it out go subscribe uh, if you enjoyed this want to see more videos like this go ahead hit that big red subscribe button uh, if you enjoyed the video uh, go ahead and leave a like I mean what the heck you know help me out and so that's pretty much it I just you know Call of Duty World War 2 I'm hyped I haven't pre-ordered it yet, but I'll probably will in the future. So if you enjoyed, hey, leave a like. And I'll see you in the next one.